looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it calls. Purgatory is the spirit's jail. Built behind the blind man's wall. Catch the specter behind the glass. He repeats the disembodied voice. It all happens when the bones are cast. After death, there is no choice. Looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it comes. Purgatory is a spirit's jail. Built behind a blind man's wall. Pastors and healers and shamans and poets. We explore. Hello, YouTubians. It's Bra here from Chasing Bones and Spirits. Current, uh, so, sorry, Chasing Bones and Spectres, current favorite of the spirits. <laughs> uh, we're here, here in uh, the Heimers Village in Northwest Ontario. Heimers was once known as the gateway to the, north, to the Northwest. Uh, we're on the site of the original church for Heimers, which is also the museum, and standing in front of the old vendor stall that used to be here. So, the, when they would have uh, functions and things like that, this is, you know, where they would set up for juices, fr you know, fruits and things like that, and, you know, give them to people. So, yeah, right now we're in the old churchyard. Hi. Yeah. Here you can see uh, what's now the, the Heimer's Village uh, Museum. <laughs> Can't talk. Coffee hasn't kicked in yet. <laughs> this is the, the first church that was in the uh, in the area, which now converted to a, a museum. Unfortunately, they got a big old chain and padlock on the door, so we're unable to take a look in. But you now we have someone tall here who might be able to peek in the windows for us. <laughs> That'd be me. Yeah. And you know, for those who know exactly how rustic we are right now, if you take a look out back, for those who aren't sure what that is. That would be called an outhouse. Uh, that is, you know, like no running water, but it does, but it does the job for self relief. Hello, my YouTubing. So we're gonna do some some EVPs. I'm gonna check out that new thing I wanted to work on, and uh, hopefully we'll get something. So we'll talk to you in a minute. All this is is white noise. So we're gonna try it. I'll try the white noise first. I got white, pink, and brown. Hello spirits, can you hear us? It's Danny. And Bra's here and Surf's here, chasing both inspectors. We wanted to try out this white noise box. I used to use it years ago, but you might not know what it is yet, but you should be able to talk through the white noise.
are you doing? Can, I, can you see? Hello? Hello? <laughs> that was Sir Sneeze. doing spirits okay we'll try this again in a little bit I didn't hear a darn thing, but we'll listen just in case the uh, we got an EVP. Okay. Oh, it does say something there. Hang on. Oh no, battery low. Ah, are you, me? are you kidding me? Battery toasted out. Oh man. <laughs> fresh batteries and it just got drained. Yep. <laughs> I think I think mer the battery fresh batteries and they just got drained. Fresh batteries I put I put them in like three days ago. Cause I noticed the battery was low. Well, spirits have been known to do those kind of things. Yeah, but why now, <laughs> Murphy? Okay. Uh, I guess we'll be listening to that later. It it said something. Oh, it did. I'm not sure what it said, but it was cool. And uh, yeah. <laughs> Go figure. Okay. We'll take a break. Back. So what, right now we're going to use my Raptor box in front of the church and museum here, located on the banks of uh, the Whitefish River in Heimers. Started scanning. Okay. Knitting. Knitting. First word that comes up, knitting. So again, you know, it's a, you know, knitting is a big part of uh, the community here. Do I have anybody with me right now? Do I have any? Uh, you bet. Do I have anybody here with me right now? You bet. Well, who do I have? Can I get a name? Are you an old member of the church? Have you been around here since the church? Settlement. settlement. Yeah, uh, the settlement, the village of Heimers. Uh, settlement. Settlement. Okay, that's twice. Back to back. Uh huh. Yeah. Um, the gateway to uh, Northwestern Ontario, that's what Heimers was called at. Logging camps, mostly. Were you part of the logging camps? Warrant. Warrant. Okay. Were you one of the strike breakers? Were you one of the, one of the workers here? Tape. Tape. Okay. Uh, tape as in, as in, we're nice. nice. 
Oh, which one of us is nice? Uh, are you saying Danny because he just joined us? Is he the nice one? <laughs> Am I speaking to a, a male or a female? Quest. Quest. You can see that. We are on a quest. Definitely. Huh. We're searching for the for the spirits and the echoes of those who used to be here. Render. Render again. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. Is there, is there something you wish to tell us? Ledge. Well, yeah, we're uh, you know, inside the bridge here. Uh, we got Danny sitting on the church steps. Want to be a little bit more forthcoming here? Would it help if I got closer to the church? Follow. We, follow. Okay. Were you one of the students here? When the church was a schoolhouse. Gate. Okay, so. Follow the gate. Follow the gate. So. Oh, grab these. Our, our answers are inside. Decided. Decided. It's been decided. Been decided. Been decided. Our answers lie inside the building. So you're going to you're not going to make this easy for us, are you? Do they ever? Oh, they know we love the challenge. Are you giving us a challenge? Inches. Inches. So, inches away, measurement. Are you one of the builders of the church? Because I notice these stairs look fairly new. The gate will open inches. Example. Okay. So the doorway is open a little bit. It's open by inches. Field. Field. Well, yeah, you were originally built in a field before the, a lot of these trees grew back up. Because this place used to be just a great big open field that they used to pile logs on, had the sawmill or the whitefish here. I'm curious as to who I'm, ta I'm talking to. Can I get a name? Heard. Heard. Okay. They heard you. So, uh, so they heard me. But uh, what is it that uh, what is it that you heard? Or is it what we heard before? What was you speaking to us before? May I move forward? The door opens a few inches. Freezing. Freezing. Yeah, it gets cold here. Were you part of the flood? Were you around during that uh, when the, the river flooded and there was ice flows going down the center of the village? That's starting to make sense. Limping. Limping. Okay. So, are are you, are you wishing to speak to Danny? You just trying to show me up because I said I was the spirit's favorite. Favorite? I was getting too cocky for you guys. <laughs> I was getting way too teacher. arrogant. Teacher. So you wish to speak to the teacher. Well, then maybe we'll get him to bring out uh, one of his boxes so you can commun com communicate directly to him because here I do have my teacher sitting on the you know the steps of the old schoolhouse and in, in church inches away from the door inches away from the you know from the gate to the what was going on is that who you wish to speak to right now remember remember yeah okay I do remember the history and so by sounds of it you want to talk to Thirteen. Okay. Okay. 
Uh, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to shut off communications here, and I'm going to pass it off to Danny. Okay. Well, thank you for uh, allowing me to, this time to talk with you and talk, talk back. And I'm going to hand it over to my teacher now. Love and peace, spirits. Scanning stopped. Hello, everybody. Time to feed these guys. Hey, good spirits. I give you this apple for energy. It's both food and drink for you. However, since we're on holy ground, by tradition and law, we will share with you. There you go. There you go. All right. We're going to eat this, and then we'll be right back. How are you? What are you doing? Liz? Hello, Liz. I don't like this. I'm going to take this speaker thing off. How you doing, Liz? Good? That's good. Trust you? No. I, I don't know you. How can I trust you? Hi, Mike. You got anything you want to say to Bra? Peace? Light? You wish in peace and light? The same? Yeah. Surf's here. Did they just say sun? Sun, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's for us, sun, surf, yeah. How am I doing? I'm doing good. How are you doing? How do you feel about this being a museum? You miss the church? It's wrong? Yeah? Well, I'm sure they're keeping the museum so that they don't have to tear it away. Yep. His dad? Who, bra? Who's this? What's your name? Alex? Well, hello, Alex. How am I doing? I'm doing good. Wow, yeah. Anything else you want to know? Just want to wish peace? That's nice, thank you. Yeah? Hello, Steve. Mel? Anything you want to tell me before I shut this off? Good. Nice day. Yep. Yeah. Are you peaceful here? Incoming. Yeah. Haunted? Haunted, yeah. Is it haunted here? By four. Oh, four people haunt this place? Yep. 
Jesus? Yes, Jesus is. Yeah. House of Jesus? Yeah. In God? Yeah. What about heaven? Do you know heaven? Yeah? Heaven, yeah. Love, heaven. Heaven, yes. So, so this is the house of God, Jesus, and heaven. Way to go. Yeah, thank you. What just? I don't know what just happened. How come surf isn't feeling good? Negative? Yeah, he's feeling negative. Can you tell, can you tell surf to feel better? Of course. Yeah. Hugs? Oh, you're giving hugs to surf? That's nice. Love, yeah. Come here, I'm right here. <laughs> you come here. <laughs> okay, I'm going to shut this off now, all right? Maybe they want Surf to Oh, maybe they want Surf to come over. You want Surf to come close? There, Surf. Hi. Hi. Surf's big, eh? What do you want to tell Surf? We're sad? Oh, you're sad that Surf is sick? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's okay. How about, how about you give Surf a big hug? I will. Okay. <laughs> give him a big hug. <laughs> all right. Okay, I'm going to shut this off now, all right? Yep. Bye. Hmm. Well, early when I asked my box, I like, do I have spirits here? And it said, you bet. So now we got some names to go with it. Yeah, yeah, we got some names. And, and they're all wishing you to feel better. That's pretty nice. And they talked about God and Jesus and heaven, which is appropriate for where we are. Exactly. Apologize for that, YouTubians. Yeah, it's not that good of a car either. I think he was going to stall out. That's why he had to do that. Yeah. Probably. Okay, we're going to take a break and we'll be right back. I just want to see if I can find a... Here we go. Excuse me. That was surf burping and not a call of the wild. spirits I got this white noise going just to see if you'll speak through it Okay, I think we got a couple of things, but it's not loud enough that, um... It's not loud enough to do what I want to do. All right, take a break. Hello again, YouTubians. Okay, we have left uh, the Heimers Village, did a preliminary walkthrough. We are going to revisit that area again. There's a lot of energy and a lot of stuff going on, so we're going, you know, we're going to go back with a better plan of action. We've now come to the cemetery of the O'Connor Free Methodist Church. Um, I have lot, I have family buried here. Uh, my family's from you know, from this area for a long time, 
and uh, you know again you know cemeteries are a great place to visit for spirits and it's been a while since I've been here so I'm not sure how they're going to take it because I haven't visited in a while but uh, we're going to give it a show, give it a go hey my YouTubians so uh, we did a half investigation half an investigation over there so now we're going to do a half an investigation over here and then next time we'll come back and we'll do the other half here and the other half there yeah yeah because <laughs> I don't know why. Anyway, we're gonna check this out and uh, we'll get back to you. Oh. Hello guys, it's Surf, Transit Inspectors. We're here at the O'Connor Free Methodist Cemetery. Found my great grandparents. Those are dad's dad's parents. And parents are just walking around. That's a horse. That's a horse. Okay. More family. So yeah, we have family like uh, over here. We got cousins, Earls, Earls and the Pogues. Pogues. Pogue. Like Tommy Pogue? No. Tommy Pogue. Betty. Betty's over there. So, a lot of the graves around here are very old. Uh, for instance, like my my grandfather Lund was born in 1876 and buried in 1960. I used to come here a lot when I was a kid. Uh, I know that family too. What family is that? Everett family. Everett? Yep. Winslow's. All these names I grew up with. I was good friend with uh, yeah. And as you can see, this is an absolutely beautiful area. This is O'Connor Township outside of Kekebeka Falls, outside of Thunder Bay. So, YouTubians, this is where the crazy Canucks grow and thrive. So, given that done, we'll, uh, we'll walk around and give my respects. Liam, hi Liam. <laughs> Liam, I can't. Yeah. Liam, uh, did you follow us from the other place? Yeah? Okay. Oh, from down over there. Hearthstone. From Hearthstone? You're visiting your dad. Your dad's here? Yep. Well, it's Liam's dad is here. I wouldn't be surprised. Whitaker? Whitaker. Isn't that Whitaker there? Whitaker there. There's a bunch of Whitaker down there, too. David. David, okay. Well, we'll look and see if we can find David. <laughs> yeah. Anybody here want to say hi to the Luddens or the Fergusons? Bread? Short Lund? Bedford. That's what he just said. Bedford Lund. Bedford, Grandpa. Oh, that's Grandpa? That's Bro's grandpa? Bra. Bra's grandfather. Yeah, but what's the name? Bedford. Bedford. Sorry, that's a tongue twister for me, Bedford. Hi, how are you? Hey, Grandpa. Hi, Joe. Hello. Hello. Mm. How are you doing? Is everything good? So, so can I ask you, uh, Bradford, for for Bra's uh, own peace of mind? Where do you reside? Heaven? Did you hear that? You reside in heaven? So. 
So, so you just pop by to visit? Oh, you just came to see him. Oh, okay. Grandpa, is your youngest boy there with you? Is your youngest boy there with you? Yep. So, so, uh, I don't know, I don't want to talk to you. I, I don't usually talk to people's relatives. <laughs> Meet the family, brother. Well, we're gonna go have some uh, pork chops. What did you hear? That sounds good, Is it, or something like that. That sounds good, that's what I heard too. I just wanted to make sure I heard it right. Yeah, it does sound good, doesn't it? Yeah, that was a deep male voice. A good meal, yes. Okay, I'll see you. Bye. Huh. Okay, I'm showing the communication. Well, there, there's a happy little chill now. I'm surprised. Okay, we'll, we'll try that again. I'm showing communication. Okay, I'm not shutting communication. You want us to walk that way? Please? Okay. Yeah? Hi. Whoever said hi to me just now? Bra? Yeah, Bra's right here. Who's that over there? That's surf. I must have accidentally... No, I didn't hit it. Ah, so there you go. So that's surf, huh? I said, who's over there? And they go, that surf. I know, I heard it. You heard it from way over there? Yeah. Holy crap. Hi. Hi, surf. <laughs> you? Do you like surf or something? Yep. Yep. I didn't see no David Whitaker. Hmm. We didn't see no David Whitaker, Liam. We didn't see uh, surf look, but couldn't find David. He's here somewhere. Okay. Well, that's fine. As long as you know where he is. Yeah. Joe. Hi, Joe. Okay. All right. Who's that? Who said hi to Joe? Sorry, I missed you. Sorry, I didn't. I didn't get it. Earl. Earl. No, there's the Earl family. Yeah, the, the Earls are, are cousins. Earls are cousins. Earls are cousins. Yeah. Okay. So, so the cousins are saying hi. Well, hey, I'd like to thank everybody for uh, talking to us. And, uh, yeah, I'm floored. <laughs> okay, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Okay, it stayed off. <laughs> All right, here we are at the end of the day. Well, today we went to Heimer's Village, Gateway to Northwestern Ontario, and found something interesting out. Uh, surfs for you know, EVP, you know, with brand new batteries in it, died. Then when we're trying to listen to it again, it died again. So we put in brand new batteries for one more time. And you know, you're able to pick up some great things that you guys will be able to hear later. Uh, we just finished a wonderful home cooked meal made by my mother out here in the country. So all in all, I'm gonna say like with, uh, at the Heimer's Village. Oh, and the, the Free Methodist uh, Cemetery where I was able to talk to my grandfather for the first time ever on my, on my dad's side, which was a surprising uh, bit of, uh, things from uh, the, the power box so again you know to our YouTubians you know this is how we do it up here with uh, the crazy connects in Northwestern Ontario hit the bell subscribe tell your friends uh, again any input you have is be more than welcome 
more than happy to see. Uh, peace and love to y'all. How are you doing? So we had a, a really good day today. Uh, we went to the Heimer's Church uh, Museum now, but it was a church. And we got some really neat evidence there. However, there's nothing, we got to go back. There's that pole, there's that, we're, we, we, did, we didn't even touch the iceberg of what's there. Uh, Bro, I felt a, a, a lot going on there. I felt a lot going on. I seen things and I'm like, okay, we haven't even touched the iceberg yet. So uh, we're definitely going to go back there. I thoroughly enjoyed the Methodist uh, Cemetery. It was real nice. I was quite surprised that uh, uh, bra, the grandfather came through and I'm like, huh, what do you know? <laughs> so that was kind of surprising and kind of cool too at the same time. Uh, yeah, so that's about it I guess. Um, so I'll be putting out where we're going next vote list for you guys so you can vote again uh, for Friday. This coming Friday we're going out so uh, like always uh, voting will be closed Thursday at noon. Unless I'm doing something that it might be a special extra vote or something, but we'll see. Anyway, until next time, take care of yourselves, take care of your family, watch out for ghosts, and have a great day. Looking into the paranormal day, death waits for no one when it comes. is the spirit's jail built behind the blind man's wall catch the specter behind the glass he repeats the disembodied voice it all happens when the bones are cast after death, there is no choice. Looking into the paranormal veil, death waits for no one when they come. Purgatory is a spirit's jail, built behind a blind man's wall. Pastors and healers and shamans and poets. We explore.